In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily download all your Google Photos at once to your computer. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes. Let's get started, guys. And first off, uh, we need to head over to photos.google.com. You can simply search for Google Photos at Google and then follow the first link. After that, click and go to Google Photos to get access to all of your photos that are stored on your Google Photos. Uh, basically, guys, if we want to just uh, download several images, we can easily do so right from here. When we hover our mouse at a picture, it will show uh, that check mark at the top left. Then we can tap on it and it gives us an option to select several images in that way. And once all the images that we want to download are selected, we need to click right here at three dots and then click at download. What that will do, that will create an archive with all that images and then we can uh, just save it somewhere on our computer. After that, we'll be able to open up that archive and uh, here, as you can see, we can find we can find images we have uh, requested for download. However, guys, if you got thousands, maybe tens of thousands images here, you cannot do so that easy by selecting each image uh, one by one. That's because we need to click right here at these three dots and then head over to settings. On settings, we need to click at manage your Google account right here and then get into data and privacy at the left menu. Then scroll down until you find data from apps and services you see. Here I already see photos, however, if you're not, you can click right here uh, where it says content saved from Google services and then just uh, scroll down until you find photos here. It says that I got over 6,000 photos and one album. To continue here, we need to click at download. Then we'll be taken to the Google Takeout service where we can download all our photos and videos at once. Uh, to continue, we need to click right here at continue. Here I also can uh, select uh, frequency. I can choose export once. It is selected by default. Or I can also choose export every two months for one year. It will make six experts within a year. I prefer to select the first one, just keep it selected and here also we can select file type. I will also keep .zip selected here and also down below here uh, we can split our export into multiple files. We can select from 1 GB up to 50 GB here. I will keep it 2 GB, it doesn't really matter for me. Then. To continue, we need to click at Create Expert. So guys, you actually may not make any changes here. Just click at Create Expert. What that will do, that will request Google to create a copy of data from your Google Photos. Uh, as you can see, now it is creating and once it is done, it will appear right here at the top. So you can wait on this page for a while. Uh, keep in mind that uh, this process can take a long time, possibly hours or days to complete. And once it is done, you will receive an email. And also we can uh, click right here at Manage Experts. I recently requested an expert and it was done in about one or two hours because I got about uh, 18 gigabytes here. Uh, it shows 
the size of your export right there and then to download this uh, data from here we just need to click at show exports and it is showing us all the files here as you can see it is split in two gigabytes archive archives and then i can just click at download button at each file to download them one by one on my computer after that i can open it up in the same way i shown you before and that's how you can download all your data from your google photos basically guys that's it so if this video was helpful for you don't forget to hit the like button